it is so comfortable but that it has the inside of like material in it so that's why i look like that but whatever is the one we are headed to tennessee we are on the road right now i am just now getting really really excited like the excitement is hitting me now i guess because we're on the road and we're actually heading there um a few hiccups in the morning like any old trip it's always something that very last minute it's like oh i gotta do this i gotta do that I, I can't find this can't find that and ryan was trying to sneak out the door with us he started paying attention once i started packing the luggage and he was like wait these hoes think they leaving me <laughs> <laughs> so he went to the door when I went to open it he literally tried to run past the bag I guess he thought he was leaving out with us so my mom had to grab him was like no they'll be back so he was at the window when we left so um yes we are on the road and I will pick y'all up past the state line or something other b-day girl this is who planned the trip who got the cabin and everything so our birthday is the same exact day so i'm looking forward to it Turn up. <laughs> gonna have some fun we just gotta get there first her piss ass gotta pee and then my sleepy <laughs> ass will sleep in under an hour you know i didn't even sleep last night and i'm still i still didn't fall asleep yet. and i was up at like one something so <laughs> So yeah, we're gonna figure this shit out. But I'm gonna pick y'all up in a minute after we get gas and stuff. And she took a piss. <laughs> I ain't last the hour. After I put y'all down, my ass start going like damn shut. Sure. Yeah, I am not to be trusted. <sighs> but I slept horribly last night. Like, I was trying to get comfortable on my mom's couch. And usually I go to sleep in a recliner, but baby wanted me to be beside him last night. And that was a no-go. I ended up getting back in the recliner. In the recliner, I sleep like a baby. So I was up at one something. <sighs> That I don't want you here. It's something about the way you stare into my eyes. I know that I don't make this.
It's cute in here, but it's a little dark. Um, I have a hater in my midst, you guys. Stay away from haters. Stay away from haters. Uh, back though, look a little sketch. It's a little, it's, it's a little river back there. Did you can see that the little river? Yeah, I'm glad I came with who I came with. People who can fight, people who can shoot, people who can stab. <laughs> Cause around, if I hear anything in the middle of the night, I don't give a damn if it is a bear. We gonna be eating bear tomorrow. I don't see that bad boy in real life. Everything is like open. Ouch. What'd she say? Hey, about pissed me off already. Lord. Talk about, uh, yeah, they've been working on that. Working on that? Um, let me call the owner. Yes. Because if they think we about to be in a horror movie, they got another fucking thing coming. Right, that too. <laughs> Man, can you bring your flashlight? I'm not stepping down there. Wow. Oh, that's the jacuzzi. But ain't no power. That mean that can't get started up either. Oh, that's wrong. She said it wrong. Oh. That's what I said. I don't even want to step down there. So that's the jacuzzi. That's the little rip. <laughs> Snowman yeah, fell down. Snowman fell down. Damn. That is shit. I don't like the privacy fence that ain't so private. <laughs> That's what I don't like. I need the whole thing to be fenced. There's probably downstairs. Oh, oh, they got branches on the uh, ceiling. Okay.
Yeah, I do not like when wood make that creep ass noise. Oh. Yeah. Y'all, this man just came over here. Hello, I live across the street. <laughs> Are you guys gonna stay here? I say it's always one. It's always one. And yeah. he scared the shit out of us too. Please leave your message. They always feel the need to come fucking say something to somebody. Like, can your ass? This ain't your shit. Stay over there. I told y'all. I told y'all. I told y'all. I told y'all. He came and walked his ass over here. Why? Why? Y'all stay in certain y'all. Y'all stay in certain y'all cells. In some shit that's not pertaining you. Hi. Motherfucker, you don't care. You don't walk up on people like that. And I had to delay recording it. Cause my hand was on something. Not playing with these folks right here. Huh? They gonna kill my gentleman. Uh oh. Oh, you're so cute. Don't touch unless you buy. I won't. Huh? It's not that I don't. Okay, y'all, so. <laughs> I can't even talk. So, a little uh, a little update. Okay, so we got to the cabin. No, wait. It was a nice ride. I think you started there. It was a nice ride. Very adventurous. Dre said it was a nice ride. And being as though he drove the entire way himself. Mind y'all, he won't let me touch the stern wheels. And I'm okay with that, you know? Shivering ain't dead. Yours <laughs> might open the door for you. Mad, don't let me touch the stern wheel, you know? I appreciate it. Um, so, I think total it was about, what, nine hours, maybe? Mm, no. Ten hours? Wait, getting here? Yeah. Uh, we left at like six. So about a about a work shift. That was yeah. about a work shift. Continue on to Parkway yeah. toward I forty. So we got here at about three thirty, and you know we wasn't supposed to check into the Airbnb till four, but my friend was like, "Well, let me see if the cold works." So it we get to the cabin. Cold right works. No electricity. No power. So we thinking it's just something they can just come flip a switch, and she's calling the you know the owner and all of that and they're like oh they were supposed to be working on that i'm going to check in with them you know just giving you any old story to get you off the phone so got a little more backstory and realized they had a storm not too long ago and not the power out so a lot of people was without power and the cabin was one of them so while we're sitting in the cars trying to figure out what we were going to do a bob walks over and asks us were we staying there you know asking a whole bunch of questions that he just felt privy to the answers they say he was just being nice i look at it as you and my motherfucking business and you should not be because this property is not yours so you shouldn't be worried about who pulled up at it okay all right so we later find out that the power had been off since Sunday and they were expecting another storm. And we don't want to get stuck in Tennessee in eight to 10 inches or whatever was supposed to come. We don't want to be stuck here. People got work to return to next week. And that's a lot more money to be stuck somewhere because no one good and got that way. Airbnb was going to continue to charge by day. And I'm not paying no way when ain't no electricity. And you gotta stay till the uh, the trees and everything else go. 
and you in foreign lands and when i say foreign <laughs> obviously we're still in the u.s but i mean you're not from around here and when the you look like me turn right and you never around somewhere, you don't want to be there longer than you scheduled to be. So we threw out some cities like, hey, where do you want to go? Where do you go? Here, we can go Georgia. We can go North Carolina. Because where we are, everywhere else is just three hours, four hours. And it's like, yeah, we've been in the car all day. But now we want to go somewhere where there isn't supposed to be any snow. So north carolina one so now we're on our way to north carolina it's about another uh Girl, you're to turn down that way. three and a half hour drive so <clears throat> and the and my friend is driving her boot her boot thing is on the passenger side because he drove all the way here he's tired so now she's driving and she's like me got a hell of a stigmatism and can't see at night and she just drove past where we're supposed to turn at so y'all just pray for us Hopefully, if this get posted and you see it, that means we made it. If this never makes it to YouTube, that means something happened. Ah! We don't know where we going. <laughs> oh, ah! oh. Ooh, so, now she getting in the left turning lane. All the way left. Ooh, so if this make it to YouTube, that means we survived, okay? We're going to survive. But, um, yeah, this is just going to be one for the books. This is going to be an adventure for the books. And when somebody say, how did you bring in your 31? Girl, do you have time? Let me tell you. She got on the, the left turning signal in the right turning <laughs> lane. <laughs> Please, Truth is, I'm tired. Options are few. <laughs> I'm trying to pray. <laughs> but where are you? How much church died? Y'all know this the funeral song. And <laughs> somebody about to be singing it for us. Because it's going to be some slow singing Don't and flower bringing. <laughs> you know they say, um. Oh, not you, not you a philosopher, because you've been negative Nancy this whole time. But now when the camera come out, you want to act all positive. They say the tongue is powerful. Well, ain't you shit positive, ain't shit positive about this whole but a COVID. <laughs> 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 We are COVID negative. I rebuke that. All the way through. And we've been keeping our mask on and not staying in these places <laughs> for too long. And they blowing at my friend because y'all she is in the wrong light. And they got a green light. Oh, Lord. Not a cop. <laughs> not a cop, Lord Jesus. Oh, I might need to work. Lord Jesus. Lord. Lord. <laughs> You can see, you can see, we got different state plates, so we exactly. not from here, y'all. Wait, oh Jesus, not about to run the light, girl. So, oh, she turning, and he pulling her over. And all three of them. Lord, y'all, they pulling her over. Is he? He's still behind them. Probably gonna get her a ticket, but we didn't know what the fuck. Babe, not you about to do the same thing. It's really turning into something else. So now we trying to get back to our friend because it look like she done got pulled over. <clears throat> and she turned her location off, so we gotta get to her anyway. That is something right here. Because it's still lights on up there. Yeah, but she don't. Fucking no, she was in the wrong damn lane. And then there's about twenty of them and Yeah, then we gotta get out of Tennessee because Tennessee we already seen all <laughs> this some scary shit. <laughs> uh, I said, why you didn't call her? Yeah, you know what you're I mean, but he can't. 
y'all that just had to say a little prayer and, and eat something and just pray that, you know, things get better. <laughs> We are being optimists. <laughs> so, the cop that pulled her over gave her a ticket for switching lanes. <clears throat> and he said she was blocking traffic. But if you look at her plates, compared to everybody else's plates, you'll see that we're not from here. So I feel like he could have left her off, let her off with a warning, you know, all it was was she was in the wrong lane. She didn't stop traffic. She didn't cause an accident. She didn't do any of that. She was just in the wrong lane. Y'all saw. <laughs> but he gave her a ticket. So now we are back on the road. We're heading to North Carolina. <laughs> um, she found another place has a hot tub. Y'all will see it when we get there. This this might be a, a two-part vlog because this is going to be way too long. <laughs> but we're back on the road, so I'll pick y'all up when we get there. See you in about three and a half hours. Okay, so the next portion of this video is going to be some pictures of reviews for the cabin that we were headed to next in Asheville, North Carolina. Now, the reviews were, whew, I'm going to just let y'all read it, so just make sure you pause to read. She blessed it definitely just came with her in the audience. It's hot. <laughs> Come on, look at the thing again. It's not that I don't want you here. It's something about the way you stare into my eyes. I know that I don't. For you every time I try to resist We can get away I'm just beach fuel And then every day All I wanna hear is an everything Now she knows she could've put some dark curtains up here Since she put dark curtains in the other room It's all black in the other room Coming upstairs This is the front door. It's not that I don't want you here. It's something about the way you stare into my eyes. I know that I don't make things clear. I fall for you every time I try to resist. Y'all, look how tight the stairway is. <laughs> this is not big hip accessible. What door is that? This is my 
Got the fan and the heater going. So is this what that door led to? Yeah. It got to see. What a day, what a day, what a day, AA. What a day. What a day, what a day, what a day, what a mighty bad day. Yes, it was. Okay, so the background looks a little different. Obviously, this is not a cabin. We left that place. It was see through curtains, it was doors with the little doorknobs. They had latches and hooks and a very, very uh, tight bathroom upstairs with the sliding door. The hallway was not thick, hip accessible or tall. If you were tall, you definitely wasn't gonna walk up those steps. They were very, very narrow. I gave the hallway about a size 13 in pants. That's about how big, how wide it was. Um, it gave me creepy vibes. The area that it was in, Airbnb, count your motherfucking days. Dre had called me from outside. So, there was a yellow bus in the yard that apparently is a separate rental, but by the same homeowner. I guess they redid the inside of a yellow school bus. And there was another set of people in there too. So it was just very sketchy. Um, the neighborhood, the house was just too open. The front door didn't have a lock on it, it was a latch. The back door had the key code lock, and that was it. None of the windows, no, no, I'm lying. Two of the windows had blackout shades on them. Everything else was just open. And I don't like that. When I'm on vacation, sometimes I want to walk around a little, little cute with my man. I know she wanted to be cute with her man, which she still may do, y'all. She don't care. <laughs> she uh, she don't care. She will walk past some window, totally naked. She good, but um. So I told her I would um, I felt a little eerie about it, and they had such horrible reviews, y'all. So I'm gonna attach some of the reviews and y'all just pause and read <laughs> I wasn't feeling it so me and baby decided to just head back home but we've been out all day and I wasn't about to put him through that drive and he wasn't about to let me drive so we ended up getting a hotel nearby and then we're gonna leave in the morning so Not going to say it was a wasted trip because it was nice. The drive was nice. Sometimes you just need a little, you know, get away. Usually I like about an hour drive, not a nine hour drive, but <laughs> um, like I said, it wasn't a wasted trip because I was still with very cool people and I was still with my baby, so... It's just, I like to listen to my instincts. And when a lot of stuff happens, y'all, y'all are going to see a lot of little stuff happen in this video that you're like, this was the trip from hell. <laughs> Which I'm sure we're all going to laugh about it once we're done living it. But um, I want to show y'all, because it's a really cute hotel room. So I want to show y'all the hotel room before I hop in the shower and lay down for the night. So... Not about the fall. So, this is the little sit down area.
and out. These are the beds. I really like the wallpaper and the lamps. Cute. And then I'm gonna stand from over here because I ain't got no clothes on. So this is the mirror, sliding door, bathroom, stand up shower. And as you can see, they have conditioner, body wash and shampoo on the wall. I think that is so cute. Hi y'all. Sink. And then like I said, the sliding door. So on the other side, this closet. And then microwave safe ice bucket. So yeah. This concludes, <laughs> I don't know what part of the trip this will be on, but this is concludes the night. I will pick y'all back up in the morning before we head out. Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Boom, ba boom, boom. My song is lost. It's, it's oomph. Okay, y'all. So, I've been looking dusty, crusty, musty this entire trip. Ain't about to put no hair on. Ain't about to do my hair. My hair's still hanging up in the window. Y'all can't see it because it's, it's in my jacket. But none of this stuff made it out the car. <laughs> ah! Okay. We're gassing up. I ain't gonna say one last time. Y'all know how these little, uh, these little mid-size SUVs do. So we're gassing up this morning and probably one more time before we hit, uh, hit the streets of home. I was about to say the city almost got me. But, <laughs> um... They're saying about six and a half hours to get home. Baby is pumped and ready to fuck to get there. So I haven't touched the stern wheel, the pedal, the gas, none of that, not one time. When y'all see me driving, it's when I'm by myself. I'm with baby. Rarely drive. Especially long trips. Ah! <laughs> baby got me scratch offs because you know I like to do scratch offs when we're out of town. Never know. Never know, never know. But, um, yeah, we are headed home. And if I catch some sights on the way, y'all yeah, know y'all will see them. But right now, it's just a whole bunch of people in my darn face wondering why I'm recording. So, I pick y'all up. After a long day of driving. Here, guys, we are almost home. Welcome home, Joshua. We are almost home. It's. I felt like majority of the trip was spent on the road. What you think? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> this, this was truly a road trip. We spent hours on the road, hours in the car. 17 hours on the, on the road and about maybe nine hours in the hotel. Something like that. And we left out at 11. So, uh, 13 hours. 13 hours in the road. It did not feel like it because I just, it felt like I couldn't get enough sleep. So I was sleeping in the car. That's why I ain't recording nothing on the way back. Because <laughs> I was knocked out. But, um... <sighs> Thank you all so much for watching this video. It's probably going to be in two parts. Because it's a lot to process. It's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot to edit. A lot to process. A lot to piece together. Because so much happened from getting getting to the first cabin and then not having any electricity trying to figure out what city to go to next getting to the next place and it being creepy and 
before going there, friend gets pulled over. So it was just a lot. It was just a lot, yo. So yeah. But um until next time, thank y'all so much for liking, comments, and subscribing and getting your girl to almost 3,000 subscribers, y'all. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate it. I hope y'all can see me because I'm taping in the dark with no flash. So, until next time, thank y'all so much. Love y'all, and I will see y'all later.